The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has uncovered an astonishing occurrence. Beams of light emanating from what seems to be an urban area, shining from a location light years away. This discovery has rekindled interest in the potential existence of extraterrestrial life. The telescope directed its focus on Proxima Centauri b, the nearest exoplanet to our solar system, and detected unusual, brilliant flashes of light. Could these emissions be indicators of an alien civilization? Stay tuned for further developments. For years, both scientists and the general public have been captivated by the idea of life beyond Earth. Any evidence suggesting the presence of life in outer space has been met with great enthusiasm. However, a significant breakthrough occurred when the James Webb Space Telescope presented compelling evidence implying the existence of life somewhere in the cosmos. While scanning the vastness of space, this powerful telescope discovered something remarkable on an exoplanet located far away. It detected lights resembling those from extraterrestrial cities, sparking the possibility that an alien metropolis might exist on that distant planet. This concept has generated considerable excitement and curiosity within the scientific community, as it could represent the breakthrough they have long anticipated. It suggests the presence of intelligent beings operating civilizations in ways we are only beginning to explore. Observing these city-like lights from an astonishing distance of four light years away, NASA engineers are astounded and wonder just how long they might have been visible in space, awaiting our technology to advance to the point where we could detect them. David Kipping, an astronomer at Columbia University, has described the planet where these lights were discovered as particularly intricate. Unlike most rocky planets that absorb sunlight and emit energy as infrared radiation, this exoplanet behaves differently due to its unique relationship with its host star, Proxima Centauri. This discovery underscores the James Webb Space Telescope's critical role. Its ability to capture infrared wavelengths was essential in identifying the unusual behavior of Proxima Centauri b, which is crucial for understanding the planet's atmospheric conditions. Researchers plan to continue using the telescope to study the atmosphere of this planet in more detail, hoping to investigate whether it might be habitable. The James Webb Space Telescope is particularly sensitive to infrared light, enabling it to observe what happens on Proxima Centauri b even during the night. Many telescopes struggle to detect faint light in the vast darkness of space, but the Webb Telescope excels at picking up even the faintest glimmers. This makes it an ideal tool to confirm if the alleged city lights on the dark side of Proxima b are indeed real. The telescope can detect artificial light in space, provided it falls within a very specific frequency range, much narrower than the light emitted by regular stars. Proxima Centauri b has a dynamic interaction with its star, which heavily influences its environment. Like many planets that orbit stars, it captures intense energy from Proxima Centauri. As the planet revolves around the star, it goes through cycles of day and night. Much like Earth, the planet experiences scorching heat during the day and cooler temperatures at night. The range of temperatures on Proxima Centauri b is vast, primarily due to its composition. For example, if the planet has an atmosphere, the temperature difference between day and night would be extreme, hot on one side and frigid on the other. This dramatic thermal fluctuation is a key area of interest for astronomers, as it provides valuable clues about Proxima Centauri b's atmospheric makeup. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its ability to image in the infrared spectrum, can effectively examine the planet's thermal emissions, offering insights into its atmospheric properties. Interestingly, the orbit of the James Webb Space Telescope around Earth coincides with the orbital period of Proxima Centauri b, enabling scientists to make detailed observations of its daylight cycles every 11.2 Earth days. If Proxima Centauri b has an atmosphere, the next step will be to analyze its chemical composition to determine if it could support life. Detecting elements like oxygen, water vapor, and methane would suggest the planet's potential to harbor life. This would involve studying the light passing through the planet's atmosphere, a complex process. While the James Webb Space Telescope is excellent for characterizing planetary atmospheres, it is primarily designed for other tasks. Its expertise lies in analyzing the concentrations of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. But it is less adept at detecting free oxygen, a crucial sign of life. 
Nonetheless, the telescope can search for other key indicators like ozone, which signals a healthy atmosphere. As scientists examine the data gathered from the James Webb Space Telescope, the hunt for distant worlds continues. The search is bringing us ever closer to answering the question of whether we are alone in the universe. It's important to note that the James Webb Space Telescope can only observe a limited number of exoplanets closest to Earth. For more detailed studies of planetary atmospheres, astronomers will rely on ground-based observatories like the Extremely Large Telescope, ELT, which is set to begin operations in 2027. The ELT is designed to offer a deeper look at the atmospheric structures of far-off exoplanets, providing clearer and more detailed data on their potential to support life. Scientists are eagerly awaiting the launch of future space telescopes like the ELT. In the meantime, the James Webb Space Telescope remains an invaluable tool for exploring distant exoplanets. Despite its limitations, the Webb Telescope continues to offer critical information that may change our understanding of what exists beyond our solar system. Researchers have ambitious plans for future space telescopes. They aim to develop technologies that reduce starlight interference allowing for better observation of the planets around them. Similar to using your hand to block the sun in order to see more clearly, these upcoming telescopes will be able to focus on the faint light reflected by exoplanets, making it easier to analyze their atmospheres and assess whether they might be capable of supporting life. However, this task is far from simple. Stars are incredibly bright, often vastly outshining their surrounding planets. This brightness makes it challenging to detect the faint light that planets reflect, light that is essential for studying their characteristics. To tackle this problem, scientists are developing several innovative techniques. One promising method is the use of coronagraphs, devices installed within telescopes that block out a star's light while allowing the dim light from orbiting planets to pass through. By carefully shaping and manipulating light waves, coronagraphs significantly reduce stellar brightness making it easier to observe the faint glow of exoplanets. Another innovative strategy is the Starshade, a massive, flower-shaped spacecraft that will operate in tandem with a telescope positioned tens of thousands of kilometers away. The Starshade functions by physically blocking out starlight before it even reaches the telescope, allowing only planetary light to be captured. This technique could be particularly effective for observing planets located within the habitable zones of their stars where conditions might be favorable for liquid water and potentially life. However, these cutting-edge technologies require extraordinary precision. For example, aligning a starshade with a telescope across vast distances must be accurate to within a fraction of a millimeter. Additionally, these systems must be compact, energy-efficient, and resilient enough to survive the harsh environment of space. Despite these challenges, the potential benefits are immense. Successfully observing and analyzing exoplanet atmospheres could reveal biosignatures, chemical traces that suggest the presence of life. Substances like oxygen, methane, and water vapor in certain ratios can point to biological processes, offering one of the most compelling indicators of life beyond Earth. Researchers are also exploring methods to directly image distant worlds in higher detail. Future telescopes may include advanced adaptive optic systems that correct for distortions caused by Earth's atmosphere or by the telescope's own movement. This would result in clearer, more accurate images. When combined with starlight-blocking technologies like coronagraphs and starshades, these improvements could allow scientists to not only detect exoplanets but also map their surfaces and monitor their weather patterns. This kind of imaging would be a major leap forward in our ability to understand distant planets and assess their habitability. As our exploration of the universe continues, the search for extraterrestrial life becomes more focused and sophisticated. The James Webb Space Telescope and its successors are central to this quest. With each new observation and each data point gathered, we get one step closer to answering one of humanity's most enduring questions. Are we alone in the universe? The discovery of light on Proxima Centauri b is only the beginning of what could become a transformative era in space science. Proxima Centauri, being the closest star system to our own, has been a subject of intense study for many years. But until now, firm evidence of life, such as artificial illumination or urban-like light patterns, has been elusive. 
The fact that such signals have now been detected by the Webb telescope greatly increases the hope that one day we may establish contact with intelligent life beyond Earth. This kind of discovery fuels both scientific investigation and public imagination, inspiring future generations to look beyond the boundaries of our planet. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues its mission, it will not only search for artificial lights but also focus on planetary atmospheres, their chemical compositions, and the essential elements that might support life. Identifying biosignatures like methane or carbon dioxide in the correct concentrations is vital for determining whether these planets have the necessary conditions for life. The Webb Telescope is uniquely equipped to examine these atmospheric elements in a way no previous instrument could, offering unprecedented insight into the potential for life on distant worlds. One of the most intriguing features of Proxima Centauri b is its position within the habitable zone of its star the region where temperatures could allow liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. This Goldilocks zone, not too hot and not too cold, is considered essential for the development of life as we know it. That's why the discovery of a planet in this region, especially one displaying possible signs of artificial lighting, is such a high priority for astronomers. Beyond identifying potentially habitable worlds, Future space missions will also explore the intricate dynamics between exoplanets and their stars. Some exoplanets, like Proxima Centauri b, are tidally locked, meaning one hemisphere constantly faces the star while the other remains in perpetual darkness. This creates extreme temperature variations between the two sides, significantly influencing the planet's climate and habitability. Understanding these temperature extremes and how they affect atmospheric circulation is essential in evaluating whether such worlds could support life. The advancement of light-blocking technologies like coronagraphs and starshades represents a major leap forward in this effort. Without such tools, the overwhelming brilliance of host stars would obscure the faint reflections from orbiting planets, making detailed study nearly impossible. By shielding telescopes from starlight, these devices enable scientists to detect the subtle light reflected by planetary surfaces, which in turn reveals crucial data about climates, topography, and biological potential. Another thrilling development in astronomy is the concept of high-resolution direct imaging of exoplanets. When combined with adaptive optics and advanced starlight suppression techniques, astronomers could soon begin capturing images detailed enough to identify features such as oceans, continents, cloud cover, or even seasonal weather cycles. These visual records would represent a monumental step in our ability to study and understand exoplanets, potentially allowing us to observe not just their existence, but their environments and biospheres. Such imagery would not only confirm the presence of distant worlds, but also provide a clearer understanding of their surface conditions and the potential for life to thrive there. As our journey through the cosmos continues, and our capabilities to observe and interpret distant phenomena evolve, the contributions of the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, and future missions become increasingly indispensable. Its unparalleled sensitivity to infrared signals allows it to detect even the most subtle planetary emissions, analyze atmospheric layers, and identify potential biosignatures that may point to the presence of biological processes. Thanks to constant technological innovation and a growing repository of astronomical data, humanity is on the verge of discoveries that could reshape our understanding of life's position in the universe. The detection of artificial light or urban-like illumination on Proxima Centauri b, our closest known exoplanet, may very well signify the opening chapter in a new era of space exploration. This ongoing search isn't just about gathering scientific evidence. It also stirs deep philosophical and existential questions. What does it mean if we find that we're not alone? How would contact with another intelligent species transform our civilization? The excitement surrounding Proxima Centauri b is a powerful reminder of our innate curiosity and drive to seek meaning beyond Earth. Future generations of telescopes, whether based in space or stationed on Earth, will continue to push the boundaries of what is observable. Instruments with enhanced light filtering capabilities, greater imaging precision, and more comprehensive spectral analysis tools will allow us to study distant exoplanets with unprecedented depth. In addition to identifying biosignatures, they might one day detect technosignatures, signals or structures that indicate the presence of advanced technology. With each passing mission, 
and every byte of data transmitted across the void, we edge closer to answering one of the most profound questions ever posed. Are we truly alone in the universe?